In this video, I'm going to show you one of my favorite little passing concepts out of the trips tied in in Madden 21. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, I just want to thank you for watching the video and I want to let you know that my channel is all about helping people become the best Madden players that they can possibly become. And so if you are looking to get better at this game, I just want to encourage you to click the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. It is completely free to subscribe to the channel and it just allows you to be able to stay up to date on all of the latest tips and strategies right here on the channel. Okay guys, so in today's video, we are taking a look at the trips tight end offense. This is one of my favorite passing offenses uh, in the entire game. And the reason why is just because it is super simple, but at the same time, it is super, super effective. And in today's video, we're taking a look at probably my favorite passing play in particular from this trips tight end offense. Um, it's a very, very simple little passing concept, but I think you're going to get a lot out of today's video because there's a lot that you can do with this particular concept. Now, if you want to get my entire Trips Tight End Offensive Guide, I'm going to leave a link in the description. I just released that Trips Tight End Offensive Guide for just 10 bucks. So by using the link that I put in the description, you can get that Trips Tight End Offense for literally just $10 completely broken down. This is the, um, this is the same formation that J-Wall used uh, this season in competitive Madden to win the club championship. So the biggest tournament in the game, he won it using the trip side in offense. So if you want to learn my way of running this offense, it is in the description right now. Um, but we're going to be talking today about drive posts. And not very many people talk about this play from trip side in, but it's truly one of my favorite concepts. And the reason why is because there are so many little valuable, way, valuable ways to run this, but here's how I would recommend starting with this, okay? So what I like to do is I like to go ahead and streak the X receiver or streak the tight end. And then the, the next little step that I'm going to take is I'm gonna take that triangle receiver here on the left side and I'm gonna put him on a little hitch route just like so. And then with my running back, because I don't have, um, because I don't have a, like hot route master quarterback, I'm gonna put him on a swing pass. You could put him on a wheel route. You could also put him on a little um, swing pass if you wanted to. If you have hot route master, you could put him on a table route, okay? That's what I would prefer to do. But for the purpose of this video, because I'm using Rogers, I don't have hot route master. So I'm just gonna use a swing route. It's, it's, it, basically they serve the same exact purpose, okay? And all we're going to do is we're just going to motion that triangle receiver over and we're gonna snap in between the tight end and the numbers. You can see kind of right in here. And basically we're going to read, this is one of the smoothest passing concepts you will ever, ever use, okay? Um, it's just super, super smooth. It's super effective as well. So if you take a look at Mike Blitz 3, this is kind of a standard setup of Mike Blitz 3, a standard way people like to use it. What's go what you're going to notice whenever we set this up is that there's not a yellow zone in the game that is gonna get out here on this triangle receiver. And because we have that nice little swing route, this is going to literally be the ultimate check down. If they play zone coverage, if they play zone coverage, and I'll show you here, I'm literally gonna drop everybody in coverage here. Okay, so there's zone coverage. If they play zone coverage, it is very likely that the triangle receiver will be wide open. If they play zone coverage, he will almost be open every single time. Again, you just wanna get him kind of out here so that those yellow zones can't drift to him. And as you can see right there, it's a consistent and easy five to seven yards. This is what we talk about when you hear people talk about trips tight end. One of the things that is the most important piece to master about trips tight end is the fact that you can create a phenomenal amount of spacing concepts. Spacing the field horizontally and spacing the field vertically is one of the most important little tips that I could give you about offense in Madden 21. And so um, this is why this play is so effective. Now the next thing that we're going to be able to do with this is we're going to be able to basically have a high-low read on the left side. And so if they're playing their yellow zones at that five-yard depth, then as you can see right there, Devontae Adams is going to be wide open over the middle of the field. Now, another thing that I want to hit on really quickly here is let's say that they're not playing any yellow zones. So let's say that they're not, they don't have any yellow zones on the field, okay? Um, in fact, they might just have one over on this side, okay? Let's just say this is kind of what they're doing, okay? So as we run this play, um, if there's no yellow zone on the field, then what's going to happen is that this square receiver is going to be a nice little check down, kind of right in here, as you can see, nice little easy check down for about five 
to 10 yards. It's kind of the theme of the trips tied in is you want to be able to take the check down. It's super, super important in this year's game. Now, what about man coverage? Well, man coverage is a little bit more, um, it's not as challenging as it used to be to beat. But on this play, the number one read you're wanting to hit against man coverage is this route to Marquez Vadas Scantling. Now, the drive post concept is a levels concept. That's why I personally prefer this concept over really any other passing concept in this game. And if you have a good receiver in that slot position like I do with Devontae Adams, oftentimes this post route is going to get nice little separation against man coverage across. As you can see, easy little read and easy laser. This is the beauty of this offense, okay? Um, now again, if they, run, if they want to run some specific types of coverages and things like that, where they're putting zone drops on their field, they're dropping people back a little bit more, then you're going to see that this circle receiver is one of those routes that will just run. And you'll see he's just going to naturally wrap around, wrap around, wrap around. And you see right there, he almost gets over the zone drop. Now, if you want, you can smart route that post route if you want it to be a little bit more unique. You can certainly do that. I'll show you what that looks like here in just a second. So we're going to run that same coverage. These are 25-yard zones. And you see here that I've smart routed the post route. What that means is this is going to turn this post route into basically a little bit of an inverted slant. And look at where he gets on the field. That's against that 25-yard cloud for, or curl flat. So he's going to get underneath at about 20 yards. You can now easily kind of slice and dice up the defense with this passing concept. So this is one of the reasons why trips tight end is so hard to guard because you have answers against man coverage, you have answers against zone coverage, and you also have answers against match coverage. So trips tight end, if you want to get my complete trips tight end offensive guide, I'm going to leave a link to that in the description. You can get that entire offensive scheme right now completely broken down with video tutorials and written tutorials as well as film study analysis that actually goes back and breaks down the offense for you in detail you can get all of that right now in one package for about 10 bucks literally just 10 bucks gets you the entire offensive system and so if you want to get my complete offensive system for the trips tied in I would encourage you to pick it up. I'm gonna leave a link in the description and you can get that right now for just 10 bucks. Thanks for watching the video. And if you have any questions, just shoot me a text. My number is 208-218-6900.